Now this is Whistler Grand, newest project that just TOP earlier this year in the west coast area of District 5. It is located within 1km of Nanhuai Primary. We have a 3 bedroom unit to show you today with some of the best views of the entire development overlooking the waterfront. Price below the 1.7 million quantum mark. So let's head up to unit and chat more. Let's go. Alright, so welcome into the unit. Before we begin the home tour, I just want to show you the unblocked views through the balcony. It overlooks the entire Greater Southern Waterfront as well as the West Coast area. So this is the newest development that popped up in this cluster over here. So buying into this area is like buying into an area of good growth potential. Now let's head back in as we talk about the facts of the property. Whistler Grand just TOP in April 2022 this year. It has a 99 year lease started from 2018, so two 36 story towers open up to the panoramic views of Bukit Timah Nature Reserve as well as Pandan Reservoir. Entire facade is lined with glass windows accented with grey curtain walls in an overall contemporary textured design. 718 units made out of 716 residential units and two commercial shops. So for the current three bedroom layout that we are in, it has only 70 units available, so that makes up for less than 10% of the entire development. This three bedroom unit type belongs to the more compact type where you don't have the yard or utility area. So if you like more storage area, then you will likely have to build in some carpentry along your living space. However, the great thing about the three bedroom compact types is that you will likely fully maximize the use of the entire floor plan to create the most efficient use of space. Alright, so let's start the home tour right now. CDL did a great job with this project. So you have quality finishes throughout the entire unit. So coming into your entrance foyer, you have this smoke tinted glass mirror, so it allows you to check yourself out before you head out. You also have this extra cabinetry done up instead of the usual single panel DB box area. So this gives you extra shoe cabinetry space, which is already built and done for you. You also have like a display area over here, which has some wooden textured finishings. So if you want to display your collectibles or your family photos over here, I think that's great. So now let me show you your dining area, easily fit up to a four-seater dining table over here. But if you want to do like a booth seating kind of thing, then I think you can fit up to even an eight-seater. That also allows you to efficiently make use of the space if you want to build in some storage area underneath the booth. Coming to your living area, the tiles are the homogeneous tiles. So what you possibly want to do is put a marble gum finish. So that gives you the long-lasting marble shine look. Viewing distance from your couch to your TV area is great. So towards your balcony, you have the three panel sliding door. The balcony is finished with this wooden looking textured tiles, glass screen, which is a bit more pet friendly than those aluminium frame types which has holes in between them. Probably do up a wooden decking as well as zip track so you can extend your living space all the way up to here. If you do a zip track all the way down, you can just actually cover it up to where the frame is. Then you can still allow natural light to come in through the glass panels. At the same time, your balcony won't be wet if it's on a rainy day. Whistler Grand is located in this new cluster along West Coast Vale, so its access is via West Coast Road and Highway. AYE is just at the back of the development. Driving to CBD takes about 15 minutes via the AYE or West Coast Highway. The R&D hub of One North is also just a 10 minute drive away. Jurong Port is also 10 minutes away, while Tuas Industrial Area is about 15 minutes away. The nearest MRT station is currently Clementi, which is about 4 bus stops away. We also have Jurong East MRT, which is also 4 bus stops away. Or you can alternatively choose to take the condominium shuttle bus service towards Jurong East MRT station. You have Jam and Westgate Malls, which have a highly curated mix of shops, including an IKEA store. In the future, once the Jurong Region Line is completed, you will also have access to Pandan Reservoir MRT at West Coast Road. Labour Gardens Food Centre is just a five minute drive away. For schools within 1km, you have Clementi Primary School, Nanhua Primary School, and Tifa Primary School. You also have tertiary and university options in the area with local polytechnics and universities, which means this area will be highly popular amongst parents as they want to plan for their children's long term study plans. Now coming into your kitchen, you have this sleek grey sliding panel door which segregates your kitchen space to keep all your cooking aromas inside. Huge ventilation window. This is also where your aircon latch is as well. Three compressors serve the entire unit as well as your city gas water heater. Galley style kitchen with very nice finishes throughout the entire space. You have your Bosch cooker hood and hob, built-in oven, fridge as well as a Bosch washer and dryer. So all these appliances are new from the developer. Top hung cabinetries as well as bottom cabinetry. Switches for your appliances are hidden right behind this cabinet over here. Ample switches over here. As well as LED lighting that is underneath your cabinet panels. Bloom soft closing hinges. Smart bin over here. It just follows the cabinet when you open and close. Open overhanging this rack. Compressed quartz countertop which is very very lasting 
and give you this nice grey finish. So CDR has done a great job with the architecture and design of this entire project. They have put in a beautiful lab pool right in the middle of the development to give more distance between the two towers. So you also have eight different pool zones for your kids to enjoy which includes like a slide and basketball hoop zone. You also have full array of facilities to choose from starting from your standard gym, tennis court and barbecue areas to a sky dining and lounge area on the 24th floor of both towers. There is also a golf practice area to save you trips to the driving range. Two levels of basement parking serve the entire development. There is even a concierge service right at the entrance of the development. So depending on what you need, you may be able to request a service from them. And for our particular three bedroom layout, they are available at stack 9 and 21. With 21 being the more premium stack as they have the benefit of unblocked views overlooking the developments in front of Whistler Grand towards the waterfront. There's something very very rare about this corridor, big ventilation window right here. So this allows some light to come into your corridor as well as some natural ventilation. Coming into your first common room, this has been set up in like a study room fashion. So some of the considerations when buying into like a newly TOP or new launch project is sometimes you may not get enough switches, but just in this room alone you already have four switches that serve the entire space. For the air conditioning that serves the entire space it is Mitsubishi Electric. In terms of pricing analysis, first off you have your triple nine year and freehold options such as Botanic near Montreal Park, 100 trees, Carabao, as well as Infinity. These developments sprouted up before the year 2010, so that's when the land cost was relatively lower. Next, you have the options nearer to Clementi MRT. And when we look at Park Clementi as well as Clevon, 900 odd square feet to about 1,000 square feet, about $1.5 million to $1.7 million, which means when you hit the resale market, asking prices over there will likely be between the $1.7 million mark to the $1.9 million mark in order to justify the investment time while waiting for the projects to be constructed. Lastly, you have this cluster, which is at West Coastville Park Rivera TOP in 2020, 904 square feet to 1,421 square feet, $1.35 million to $1.85 million. PSF pricing is at about $1,200 to $1,600. Then you have Twin View, which just TOP last year, 904 square feet to 1,055 square feet, $1.42 million up to $1.85 million. PSF pricing is at about $1,400 to $1,800. Lastly, you have your unit at Whistler Grand, 958 square feet unit, $1.69 million, 1,700 PSF. The higher the unit, the more premium it commands. So if you're considering one of these units and you do not want to pay for the most premium unit available, then you may want to consider something at the mid-level where you're cushioned between the higher floors as well as the lower floors units. Alright, so now let's move into the next common room. So right now we have fitted the common bedroom with a single size bed. You can even fit a queen size bed over here if you want to. Flooring provided by the developers is a vinyl flooring. You also have this huge floor to ceiling windows which are slightly tinted. You're also on a south facing so the unit has somewhat of like a north-south orientation. So for all the rooms from the living room all the way to the master bedroom, you get the same views which is towards Pandan Reservoir as well as the southern waterfront. This view is virtually protected for you already. Before you enter your master room, we have this common toilet over here. You have your vanity mirror area over here. So you have LED lighting underneath the cabinet, storage spaces behind the mirror, grow her toilet fittings, storage underneath your sink area, huge ventilation window which will exude all the humidity in your toilet. The developers actually chose to go with a three-tone finish towards the entire toilet. Now moving on to the master bedroom, same vinyl flooring as the other rooms as well, a sliding wardrobe, haptic soft closing mechanism, queen size bed as well as a side table. You can even go up to a king size bed and put a side table on the other end over there, mount your TV on this wall over here. Now let's talk a little bit more on the financial analysis if you're considering to buy a three bedroom unit in this area of District 5. So for a $1.69 million property, assuming you're able to take the full 75% loan at 3% and a 30-year loan tenure, your monthly mortgage is $5,344. And if you're to compare it, buying a $2 million property one of the developments nearer to the MRT station, at a full 75% loan and 3% interest rate as well as a 30-year loan tenure, your monthly mortgage repayment is $6,324. And that will mean a monthly mortgage difference of about $980 between the $2 million property and the $1.69 million property. And of course, with that price difference, you can have a few options. Perhaps you want to buy a car to get a greater level of convenience for you and your family. You can still choose to take like a ride hailing service every day, which also works out to be less than the $980 difference. Alright, so last but not least, let me show you the master toilet. I think it's very generously sized wash up space over here. Toilet bowl from Duravit. And again, all your other fittings are from Goher. Storage spaces behind the vanity mirrors, as well as underneath your sink. Metal casing cabinets over here. Ventilation window right beside your shower as well, which overlooks your neighbor's view. But not to worry, the window is tinted. Alternatively, if you want more privacy, then you can consider something like a shower blinds. And the developers has also given you like a ledge for you to put some of your shampoos and facial washers over there. Keep up with the small talk. First call with the brakes off. We don't need to see that far. 
So if you'd like to view this 3 bedroom unit in the newest condominium project that just TOP in April, priced under 1.7 million quantum, then do give our listing managers a call at numbers that we just flashed on the screen. Do like and subscribe to our Property Team Brothers YouTube channel and as well as our social media. Property Team Brothers, always happy to show you the place. Open up the panoramic views. I said panoramic. Right? So in Whistler Glen, right? Whistler Glen. Who's Whistler's Glen? <laughs> we don't know him. That's me, Melvin Palmer. Stop this. I am so weird. Like for guys, it's like this. Then like for the ladies, it's always like this. <laughs> <laughs>